What's up everybody? My name is Max Baker, sales engineer for Balif. Today I'm going to talk to you about a few solutions for feedback on your pneumatic cylinders. The first one here is what Balif calls a V-twin. Now at first glance, these may appear to be normal reed switches, but they are not. A couple significant things here. Where reed switches are prone to failure, these use solid state magneto resistant technology, which is going to be much more durable and reliable. The other thing is, there are two sensors back to one connector. In this case, giving you an extend and retract position. This also cuts out the need for a second cable. So whether you're running them back to an iLink master or hard wind back to a controls cabinet, you're cutting out the cost of the extra cables. Now these are great if you only have two positions, but what if you need more than that? This is where Ballast's magnetic position sensor comes in, or as we call it, the BMP. This is able to read the magnet in the cylinder's piston and give you continuous feedback across the length of the sensor. This sensor comes in lengths from 32 millimeters all the way up to 256 millimeters in 32 millimeter increments. No matter what length you select, that one part number can be mounted on a C-slot, T-slot, round body, or tie rod cylinder. Just select the appropriate mounting hardware. In addition, this one part number is capable of communicating 0 to 10 volts, 4 to 20 milliamp, and of course, IO link. We have seen these used in a ton of different applications. Some examples are pneumatic grippers, gripping different parts, format change, and gauging equipment. Resolution is 16-bit for analog and one micron on IO link. Well, that's all I've got for you today. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out, and thanks for watching.